today we are going to uh, try in a couple of scan appliances. Uh, we're going to try in the upper, we're going to try in the lower separately to make sure that they fit with, uh, with no, no wobble, that they have a nice positive seat. Uh, and then we'll put both in and check the bite. And uh, then we'll take a bite, we'll take a CT scan. So let's try in the upper first. If I'm pinching anywhere, let me know. No. All right, so we just wanna make sure that they're stable. There's, um, I think it's mostly tissue contact on this, mm -hmm. on, on this arch. So as long as it feels stable and you know, have a nice positive seat, then that's what we're looking for. Feels pretty solid, right? Mm -hmm. No rock. Okay. All right. Good. good. Well, let's try the lower. All right. Now this has a lot bigger flange. I bet this, this is not very comfortable at all. It's like wearing a denture. But this is gonna it basically simulates a, a seating a denture, and it does have um, one one tooth in the anterior. But really, it's a tissue supported tissue supported guide. How does that one, how's that one feeling? Feels pretty good. There's just a slight, but go ahead and lift your tongue all the way up. There you go. No, not too bad. Okay, so that could be a little bit of bounce on tissue and that's, mm -hmm. that's kind of expected. Yeah. And the flange is pretty long, so. Okay, is that pinching down, down here anywhere? Lower in your vestibule? No, okay. Yeah, I'm pressing pretty hard on it too. All right, okay, okay. so I'd say they've seat well. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we'll insert both. Sorry, mouthful of plastic. Oh, and my fingers. Yeah. So once they're seated, it'll be a little more comfortable. And the idea here is that with both of them in, we want you to be able to bite down. Oh, you tell me when, sorry. I'm no, you're bite, bite too early. And we want to make sure that the occlusion is good. Now these are, uh, with, with a lot of these, we make um, clasps, metal clasps, but we just can't make it uh, on these because we don't you know, have enough teeth to hold on to. But So we're going to make sure that when they're seated, they're not, or when you're when he's biting down, that they're not rocking at all, that they have a nice full seat. And then, can you tell us if it's maybe hitting in one area before it's digging another? Digging out here. Oh, it's digging, digging down, down here. Yeah, yeah that's, that's down in the flange, yeah. But you want to check to make sure that there's no rock. But if you if you were to open a little bit and then and then close just a little bit and then bite down, does that feel like in, in the teeth area? Does that feel like it's hitting pretty evenly everywhere? Okay, well that's what we're looking for. Okay, all right. So with these tried in, so there's there's a little bit of an aesthetic um, try in too. I mean we're making this from our try in from our setup for dentures, and so the midline tooth shape, tooth size, amount of exposure. That's what we're also having a look for here too. Open. Tap, tap. And open. Do you want to slide it all? I presume it's, it's holding it probably, right? Okay. Yeah. Okay, holding on that side. Let me just try on the other side. Bite and hold. And yeah. holding. Okay. All right, so we have bilateral contact. Do you care where the cotton rolls are at? Uh, no, just, just bilaterally biting. Open. Open for me. Um, quick, so say it's open. It's hard. I know. Go ahead and open for me. Yep, and they can even be sticking out sideways. They don't. Is yep, that okay? Yeah, yep, just like All right, that. So chin in the clear, chin rest for me. Do you think are those are those holding the appliances seated? Mm -hmm. I have those? it on this one. Yeah. Okay. On the actual appliance. Okay, so they're not tipping or. It's, it's holding them one up and one down. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right, good. I'm gonna straighten out your, there you go. Does that feel like you're standing up straight? Mm -hmm. Okay, try your very, very best not to move, okay? So then we wanna take this chin rest out. Unless your chin rest can you know, support a prosthetic, we'll take this out and swap it out with a scanning table. Maybe you can edit out our uh, thumb <laughs> Very nice. So that's they come in all shapes and sizes, but that's a that's a scan table, and the appliances will sit right on top of this. We also want to make sure that there is some separation. Um, a little scan here, a separation between the plastic table and the appliance. 
because they're both made of resin and uh, the scan when it comes over it'll look like they're the same material we can't separate them so we always want the prosthetic floating above the plastic table either on cotton rolls or a piece of foam the gauze the gauze should work it'll create enough of a space between the table and the appliance so this is an upper so just do teeth down on the upper and then teeth up on the lower and next is the lower all right so this the plane of occlusion isn't that important just we want teeth up all right so we checked it with equilibration paper and now we're going to try them in and take a bite Open. Ah. Sorry, is that your cheek? Is that better? Uh -huh. okay. Does that bite feel okay? Is that alright? Okay. Just stay open. I'll tell you when to close. Stay open. Yes. Open. Right on your back teeth. I crushed it up the other side. You just gonna do one? I was gonna do two of them, but it's kind of it's kind of hard because it's not really staying in there. Right now, just don't open, please. Just so right here. Yeah, and even yeah, you see wherever there's a little bit of a gap, an overjet gap, you can just fill that with material. Yep, and you can fill that, and then right under the anteriors. That's it. Perfect. Mm -hmm. That that captures the bite. Right. That took two bites. Always like taking sectioned bites as opposed to one roundhouse so we can see how the teeth are coming together while it's setting. And those are the records.